Hi everyone, welcome back to Colouring with Kate. Thank you for joining me today. So I've just received these books and I thought I'd do a quick flip of them. So thanks to Zoe from Addicted to Colouring, um, she alerted us with a short um, little video to say that these were some new releases from Morgan O'Brien and so I just couldn't help myself but order, ordered them. So I ordered the Matchstick Mouse a Summer Colouring Book. Um, then the Chompy Fluff Monsters. I mean, there weren't many inside images of this to show. Um, so, in fact, there weren't any. So um, I took a little bit of a, you know, a little bit of a punt on it and decided to order them. So I ordered the Volume 1. I went and ordered the Volume 2, of course, and the Volume 3. Unfortunately, this one here is damaged. I don't know if you can tell, but it is, it's got bend really quite a bad bend throughout the whole book so I'm probably going to return this but I thought I'd do a quick flip of all of these first um, so let's start with Matchstick Mouse a Summer Colouring Book um, I think Pixie's Projects has also got this um, flip on her channel as well so I had a little bit of a look but not a not a proper look because um, I thought I'd, I'll do a flip and have a look when it arrives it's always nice to be excited when you're receiving a new book so yeah this is definitely one that I really want to colour in because summer is pretty much coming up so yeah that's a matchstick isn't it I think that he's got there that he's holding so cute I love the circular images I think he's going fishing there and the worms fishing as well bring you in a little bit so you get a better glimpse of it better look of it it's only a picture in the little circle so he's got his little friend the worm with him everywhere and this little beetle so so far I have just coloured in one of these um, one page in, in Morgan O'Brien's book I think it was in the autumn book I think I put my picture on Instagram I mean it doesn't take long to colour these beautiful little cute pictures and I just, I love them, I just think they're so nice. I think I'm going to do a um, buddy colour with, with Zoe. I think we're sort of sorting out a buddy colour of a page. But yeah, Zoe is definitely my um, enabler. She's just such a lovely person. cute one as well. She sent me a few of the images um, that we could buddy colour and I actually really liked all of them so it's got a very similar taste. It's a shell I think, it's quite listen to the sea. Just so cute. Oh I can't wait for that sitting on the beach having some ice cream. But yeah, I mean, this is another one of my um, favourite artists now, Morgan O'Brien. <laughs> that one's really cute. It's like each picture can tell you a little story as well. And I think those, um, you know, I really, really like those sort of pictures. And I really want to colour those. Oh, it's using a spoon as a, as an um, oar. So I'm not going too slow with this, I'm going at a brisk uh, pace because I want to show you his, uh, his other books uh, which I've also purchased. So yeah, I was disappointed to see the one of the books was damaged but yeah. I like my books to be pristine. I think they need to send books, Amazon need to send books in, in the hard um, cardboard envelopes so that you know they don't get bent it's having a nice nice relaxing time there and that's it so yeah that's a matchstick mouse um, a summer colouring book so the next one 
are these three books, um, which is another of his series. So Trompy Fluff Monsters. Now I thought these were also going to be circular, but they're not. But I'm not. I haven't had a look at these at all, really. I just had a little flick, and that's it, and not a good look. So we're going to start now. This is volume one. Um, you can see the back of it as well. So yeah, decided to just buy all three. I've sort of accepted Amazon printed paper now because. I love the images, so I'm going to just use them. Isn't that cute? Bring you in a little bit so you can see it a little bit better. So cute. That's his little baby. Yeah, definitely nice. Oh, definitely cute. It's jumping off. I like that some seem a bit more detailed than others and I like the this sort of I don't know how you design like I don't know this sketchy sort of design art style and again um, I think these are simple enough to to colour and there's a bit of a background which you could add as well I guess to make it look nice oh look, they're in two little tiny dinosaurs in like a bit of a fossil of a dinosaur left over there just really like dinosaurs and cute dinosaurs even more so yeah I, I definitely will look forward to colouring this and um, I'm actually going to try to use my and I have been actually using them, my Bambino crayons a little bit more especially on um, Amazon printed paper because um, when they're simpler pictures and I can't really use watercolour it'd be nice to fill larger areas with the Bambino crayons I just wish Bambino crayons um, get some more shades out and give us more choice because there's only 24 available I think Lucy used some in her video recently as well she was saying the same thing it'd be so nice if they um, came out of the bigger set but yeah, I'm really liking this book so far. Oh look, the plain hide and seek. So cute. So this is more of a detail page. And there's one hiding there as well. It's more of a detail page. I think there's someone's eye there as well. So might be one hiding up there. And there's less detailed ones. So I like the variety of that. Oh, that's such a cute one as well. And then that's it, so that's Trumpy Flush, Fluff, not Flush, Fluff Monsters. So there we go, so that's that one, that's volume one. So now for volume two. So again, simple book belongs to page there. The title page. I don't want this video to be too long, you see, because I want to upload it straight away, really. <sighs> Love this one so cute it's all these little little babies there Pterodactyls. These sleeping sleeping dinosaurs or oh. didn't have a little bit of a game there, slide. So I just thought I'd go ahead and just buy all three because I know that I'm gonna get it sooner or later. Like that one. Just 
really nice. Just sat beneath a massive palm tree there, volcanoes in the background. But yeah, these, these are lovely pages. The beak on that one. Oh gosh, you've got butterflies there. Top of the dinosaur. But yeah, I love cute stuff, so this was definitely um, up my street. Oh, it's carrying its little um, baby like a cat carries a kitten. So that's that one. So that's Chompy Fluff Monsters, uh, a dinosaur coloring book, volume two. And then the volume three one, a little upsetting because it's damaged, but I am going to send it back and get a replacement, a dinosaur coloring book. So we have, don't know why this one was like a little bit damaged when the other one wasn't. So it's a bit weird. And the other ones were, were okay generally. So again landscape pictures for all of them uh, we've got this pterodactyl it's quite happy um gosh that's quite nice that one's getting some sunshine i think there Really like that one. So you do get quite a few pages for it, but in each book, quite a few images. Oh, I really like that one. That one is so nice. like a t-rex just looking up at something there oh that's little dinosaur family the little children there looks like it's snowing there I mean, some of these that are really simplistic, like the, the previous one, you could do in, I don't know, half an hour or less, um, especially if you're using alcohol markers. But yeah, they're, they're nice little cute pictures to just have fun with, really. mouse. I don't know if mice existed really at that time. Oh I really like this one. I like the ones with, um, the ones, I like them all but the ones that are my favourites are the ones with a bit of a scene, like these ones, you know, so I can sort of colour the scene as well. But there's a variety, so, you know, whatever the mood takes you to. So, yeah, those are my flip throughs. Um, I hope you enjoyed the flips of all these books. Um, so those are the Chompy Fluff Monsters Volume 1, 2 and 3. And, of course, the new Matchstick Mouse Summer Colouring Book as well. Newly released books from Morgan O'Brien. Uh, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, take care. Bye.